Good morning. So we're in the hotel here in Mishawaka, Indiana. Getting ready to leave here in just a minute. We're heading to Tony Saddle Shop in Valparaiso, Indiana, uh, before we head to Moni, Illinois, to catch up with LNK Tech. We're going to drive right below Chicago. We're not going into Chicago on this trip, uh, but we'll be close enough to smell it. Um, we'll do. We'll save Chicago for another trip. Um, clearly, I can't go like this. So give me a minute. I gotta go change. Well, what are you waiting on? Let's go! Alright, so we're off to Tony Saddle Shop in Valpracio, 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 Valpo, Indiana. About an hour, hour and a half away from where I'm at right now. And, uh, System it's a... Clearly, there's problems, but uh, the ice is still a little bit bad, and traffic's going to be a little bit rough at the moment, so wish me luck.
All right, we're leaving Tony's Saddle Shop. Good meeting, good, good meeting with Linda, Sam, and Jennifer. And uh, yeah, we're off to Moni, Illinois to hook up with Kim at LK Tech. About an hour and 45 minutes, two hours away from where we're at right now. So we got a little bit of a drive and we're heading to Illinois. Yuck. So change of plan, uh, LK Tech just called and canceled. Uh, they got some ice down there. Ice is kind of being my enemy all all week, isn't it? But anyway, uh, so we're not going to go to LK. I think I'm going to stop, get a hotel, and uh, In one quarter just mile, regroup. Make a slight right turn onto I-57 south towards Kentucky. So, um, so yeah, that's my plan as of right now. I'm going to stop, get a hotel, find out just how far from Wapella. I am where we're going to be tomorrow morning, and uh, I don't know, come up with a new plan. <laughs> All right, good morning. Uh, so we're leaving the hotel here in Tinley Park, Illinois, just south of Chicago. We're heading to Wapella, Illinois, to visit with Gina and the crew down there at Circle H Western Wear. Um, cool store. Something neat about it is it's actually attached to a to an auction house. So uh, they do both. They have a Western store and an auction deal. Yeah, we'll get to visit a little bit of both of those. About two two and a half hours from where we're at right now uh it's cold it's cold cold on a good note the sun came out so that's exciting <laughs> all right uh we're off
All right, we're leaving Circle H, Wapella, Illinois. Uh, also, Haycraft Auction Company. Um, great, great visit with Gina. Uh, she's always super, super nice. It's fun to hang out with people that are just that genuinely nice. Um, we're about six and a half hours away from home, so we're not going to make it all the way home. Obviously, I'm shooting for Indianapolis. I'd like to make it to Indianapolis tonight. Uh, crash there and then get up and do the rest of the trek in the morning That's about all I know <laughs> See ya Good morning. So we're leaving the hotel here in Fishers, Indiana. It's fairly early this morning. It's still dark. Um, it's cold. It's still cold. My truck's saying it's negative five degrees right at the moment. I want to leave right this second, but I kind of got blocked in by a couple of jack wagons. I'm not sure if you can see them or not. So I guess I ain't going nowhere until this these guys let me leave. Jack wagons. Sheesh. We're about three, three and a half hours from home currently. Uh, I'm, I am going to make one stop along the way. Probably won't take you all with this. Uh, mostly just the store is not that photogenic. Um, but yeah, excited to get home. Probably stop at the feed store on the way home. Um, but yeah, just really excited to get home and hang out with Jane for a little bit. It'll be good. tell you all uh, about this week I had a little bit of a tragedy my little generator that I used to run the boot trailer died on me this week it didn't only die it had a fire so yeah I didn't have it all week so that was a that was a real problem the bigger problem is going to be when I inform Jane uh, that it's gone and that I need at least a thousand dollars to get another one it'd probably be easier to argue the government shutdown with a complete stranger but that's what I'm up against. That's what I gotta do. Wish me luck. That's gonna be. It's gonna be hard. <laughs> I was ready to die for what? 